Terrence Mann tight ropes the baseline. Now they go into Zubats on the mismatch. Double tries to pass out of it on the ready hands of Chris Paul right there. And I'm quite sure that is unfamiliar territory for Zubats. Double teamed right there on the block. I think it's a smart move, but kind of throw him off a little bit. Gallo has been very special in the mid range this season. Cannot convert there. I know there's going to be a lot of energy for Oklahoma City with three former Clippers going up against their former employer. Chris Paul unable to convert there. That's funny you say that. I mean, you got three guys that are motivated to really come out here and play well today. The step away from Paul George, and now it's becoming put by Mo as well. Beverly all alone. That provokes a three. Zoo with the rebound and the putback. Seven points, nine rebounds. Puts you in tough positions as a defender where he can use his length. Beverly stonewalled by Gallo, flings it to Zoo for three. He's been working on that shot in the offseason. It doesn't use his Adams as a barricade. Good defense by Zubats on both Chris Paul and Steven Adams. Clippers looking to break the tie. Only after it. Not just that, he said he's just such a great person. He said sometimes coaches get frustrated, you want to throw in the towel, but Shea is the kind of player that makes you want to coach. Jamie, great stuff as Avita Zubox jams in and one thing to do last year in the regular season. Flings a three. Nerlens Noel out there gets it back in the corner to Ferguson. Oklahoma City 0 for 3 from distance in this first quarter. Downhill gets to the rim, challenging Noel. Oh, how about Avita Zubac with a right-handed follow? He continues to get better game after game. I mean, he's been good all season, Zubac, but he's always in the right positions. And that's as a big man, you have to position yourself to be able to get offensive rebounds, defensive rebound, tip ins, charges. He's just doing a good job of understanding position. Pat Beverly gets into. Zubats can't find a white jersey. Finally gets it over to Beverly. Man all alone with time and space. No, how about Zubats again? A whistle and a foul as well. Clippers just two of their last ten from the field. Nader to the rim, count it, and give him one more on the house. Point game. Terrence Mann back out there for Doc Rivers. A lot to Zubats. Zubats was a star in the first quarter as the ball. Chris Paul tailgated by the rookie man into the paint. Surrounded by defenders, finds Ferguson straight away for a three. And Zubats comes away with rebound number seven. Man got away with a bit of a hook there. Finds an open Beverly for three. Running rebound for Chris. I have to impact this play. Pat was saying for a review, he thought maybe a flagrant, as the replay showed us right there. Nothing flagrant about it. Another turnover for the Clippers. There's seven. Ferguson, he's athletic. Gets it to Gallo. Blocked. And the ball knocked out of bounds by Chris Paul. Always in the wrong. It would sweeten the pot. It's not an indictment on his ability at all. It's just the expense of his contract that is remaining over $100 million. Well, of course, you know, if he stays, he can help them make the moment. But that's when you, when you have a defense like the Clippers have, you're always in a game. Schroeder, straight but strong, and Zubats has the rebound. I love that the, the Clippers have so many guys that can get it off the glass and push, and not only... George comes off the screen from Zub, dumps it back to the big fella, surrounded by defenders, but he can't lay it in. Nice play right there by Paul George and also it's a good play by handoff where Chris is going to that right where you can't stop him and, and, and push him back to that left hand. George for a straight on three, book it. And the Clippers pulled over within two. Timely basket. Absolutely. George to Zubac, juggles. Patterson picks up the loose ball. Zubac just battling inside, trying to keep it alive. Out to make them pay for some of those mishaps. Two man game with Lou and Pat Bev. And how about a two man game with George and Zubat? Hit from behind, and Zub will go to the